Good everyone, my name is Graphics. If you look at the right hand side of the screen, you will see a question, and we are told to reproduce that figure you see in isometric projection. Now, the first thing you do when you hear the word isometric projection is for you to draw your isometric axis, right? Taking your C square or C square and you draw your vertical line you draw your two inclined axis one of them is the Z and the other is the X you can see that now the next thing is for you to draw the entire length entire height and the entire width now the entire length here as you can see is 72 so from here I am going to measure 72 from 0 and this is 72 here and the entire width here is given to be 50 as you can see so from this point to this point here is 50 and the entire height is given to be 65 that is 12 plus 28 plus 25 that is what 65 so i'm going to come here and i'm going to measure 65 from this point from 0 to 65 then i'm going to take my instrument and i'll measure the vertical on that point now take it and I'll close it up this way close it up and also close it up and also close it up and I'll be having this Hope you can see what we have accomplished now if you look at the diagram very well from here to here you start from this curve part to be more easier so let's start from the curve part now since we are told to draw that curve part I'll just take my compass right I'll place it at this end here let me bring it down so you can see what I'm talking about I'll place it at this point here here to this point hope you can see that from here to here and I'm going to mark down hope you can see that and I'll use my instrument you know just draw a line this way on that point right and the thickness given you can see is 12 so i'm going to measure 12 from this point here from 0 to 12 this term level 12 here at this point here and i'll take it down straight ahead to touch here and also, I'll take this one down too, straight ahead to touch here. And I'll move this this way, straight ahead to touch here. Then from here, I'll do the same thing too, straight ahead to touch here. Hope you can see that. And I can easily take this two from this point, straight ahead, faint line to touch here I'll come here this is thickened I can easily thicken this this way I can come here to thicken this this way I'll come here to 
Second is this way. Then from here to second is this way. Then from here to second is this way from here. Right? And from here also. I'll take here. And from here. I'll wait a little bit. This shape you see here is given to be from here to here is 28. So I'm going to get the center of this figure here. Right? So what I will to get the center is I'll draw the diagonals. If I connect from here to here, which is where they yeah, are meeting, that's the center here. Then I'm going to draw a vertical line downward this way. On the top here and draw another one this way can you see that so i'm going to measure 28 upward so if i place it this way i'm going to measure 28 millimeter upward from 0 20 28 here and i'll take my instrument and then i'm going to close it up this way If I close it up this way, and the thickness is given to be 8, meaning that from this point here, I'm going to measure 4 to the right and 4 to the left. From here, this is 4. Right? And from here also, this is 4. This is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Hope you can see that. And I'll do the same thing here too, from 0, from this point, I'm going to measure 4, and from this point I'll measure 4. And I'll take my metal rule, as you can see, I'll draw a straight line from this point to this point, this way. I'll do the same thing here too, right? And I will close here too. And I'll bring here down too. From this point. Alright. And I'll take here straight down here too. And also here too. Right and here too. And here too. If I will do that, I will do on there first of all. Right? I will just uh, complete here. You can see that? Now our next target is this curve that we have here. Which I will be focusing on this side here. See what I want to do? I'm going to join the diagonal from here to this point. Right? This diagonal through from here to this point. So they are meeting at this point here. So from that point, I'm going to draw a line that will go through that point this way. Right? So I am focusing on, let me say here is A. Here is B, here is C, and this part here is D. So, from, let me call it to be P. So, from P, I'll draw a line to go through A. From P, I'll draw a line to go through B. What do you notice? They are touching at this point and also at this point here can you see that so i can now take my compass i'll place it here take it to b then connect c hope you can see that i'll come again come to this point here take it to b 
and connect A. Can you see that? Then I cannot bring here down from here. Cannot come here to here down from here. Hope you can see that. Now the next one is the back one. Now I don't have to construct anything from the back. I'll just take my instrument and join this point to this point here. Just like I drew from here to this point. And I'm going to transfer the points. So if I take my instrument, just uh, transfer this point from here. It will give me this point. And from here, also give me this point. Hope you can see that. And the last but not the least, I'll just connect this point. Just draw a straight line from here where it meets this point is here. That is what I just need. So, where this line meets this line, I'll take my compass to that point and bring it from the top here. Here it may be. Then I'll get down here. All together. Now come to be this point here, just like I use here to get here, I'll use here to get here. No we'll stop here. Hope you can see that. Then I'll take my instrument to color up here. That's the color up here. And also up here so this is what we have is that again this is what we have as displayed at the right hand side of the screen so I'm going to do the dimensioning this is what we have here so you measure from here this is start five from here to the center where the circle is is 28 right this is what we have so if you have found this video helpful please don't forget to like subscribe and also share the video thanks for watching